Fritz and Witz Mantel came to fame as long-distance experts, when they actively partook in the Dutch pigeon sport up till a few years ago. With a number of NPO victories, and having represented the Netherlands on an Olympiad with Olympic Amador and Olympic Cape, Fritz and Witz can proudly look back upon the highlight of those times. Since their move from Bergen to Udiga, Netherland. However, the focus has been on partaking in one loft races. To be able to excel in that discipline, the quality of the partaking pigeons has to be of an incredibly high level. Armed with a breeding loft that is filled with descendants of the old guard, reinforced with NPO and OLR winners, has resulted in several impressive successes. Investing in NPO winners After NPO winner Vardy, Fritz and Witt started searching for pigeons of the same quality. And only when both of the gentlemen are convinced that a top pigeon, one with an NPO victory, will mean a reinforcement for their breeding loft, they will try to get that pigeon. They have managed to claim three NPO victors so far, of whom the children got to prove or have proven themselves on the OLR. From the brothers Leidman came an L18 145-9308, Starling, first NPO Troys, 511 kilometers against 3,783 pigeons. Also from the brothers Leidman came an L14 146-6945, Vitoria, first NPO Nantoil, 467 km, against 3,926 pigeons, Tuadiga. Vitoria proved herself on the breeding loft as the mother of 5th Quirain against 10,570 pigeons, and an 8th Munster against 1,625 pigeons. The third NPO winner came from G. Bielen and Son, from that combination came an L15 138-50-18, Alice who made a name for herself with a first NPO melon against 3,701 pigeons. Alice is the proof that the strategy of Fritz and Witz is working. In 2021, a note could be added to Alice as the mother of NL21 148-4501, Miss Sophia who put down an impressive performance at the Sophia OLR. Grandson Alexio is Vardy's potential successor. Fritz and Witz managed to bring back one of their entered pigeons, which excelled in a OLR final, back to Udiga. NL 22805-3937, Alexio not only won an impressive 7th final Algarve Golden Race, 505 km, in Portugal, and a 76th race to against 4,874 pigeons, but also embodies the best bloodlines of this combination. Alexio is a son of top breeder Alonso, Olympic Amador cross Tim Woman, cross Amy came from, Vardy cross Peace. Fritz and Witz have put their faith in Alexio to build upon the successes of his grandfather Vardy. They predict that Alexio will be their future stock pigeon. Alonso, father Alexio, together with Vardy lies at the foundation of many highlights star breeder NL16 184-78-75. Alonso, is almost as highly regarded as Vardy. This blue cock won first weird against 2,227 pigeons but impressed even more as father of various one-loft race stars. Alonso is son of Olympic Amador, first Olympiad pigeon 700 kilometers in 2017. In 2018, a child of Alonso won a fantastic 18th final Algarve Golden Race against 2,132 pigeons. In 2019, Alonso became father of 23rd semi-final of this same Algarve Golden Race. In 2022, children ranked 31st hotspot 3 VFW CPR and incredible 7th final Algarve Golden Race against 3,622 pigeons. In 2023, the offspring of Alonso once again played an important role in the OLR scene. Jason is father of eight first prize winners. Another invaluable crack of combination mantle is an L17 162-27-37, Jason. This cock descends from the same lines as superbreeder Vardy. His father, an L15 120-86-93, Milan, is a full brother of Vardy. Jason is father of eight first prize winners, and also at OLRs his children perform outstandingly. For instance, 
Jason is father to 9th final Sophia OLR in 2022 against 983 pigeons and 4th ace pigeon of this same race against 1,903 entered pigeons. Furthermore, the checkered Hanan L18 145 9308, Starling is housed on the breeding lofts in Udiga. This hen previously races on the lofts of Gabroder's Leidman, winning first NPO Troys, 511 km against 6,301 pigeons. This fantastic hen thereafter moved to Combination Mantle where she fully met her high expectations as addition to the breeding lofts. Thank you for watching. Until next time.